New genetic and anatomical techniques have revealed the bizarre face of cow observed by Charles Darwin 180 years ago in Argentina. The unusual short-faced bovine known as the Nyata appears very much to be the cross between a cow and a bulldog, though researchers say it did not suffer the breathing or eating problems that might be expected. While the animal has since become extinct, scientists were able to use skeletons collected around the world to better understand its anatomy and evolution. Very few people know that hundreds of years ago a cow with a face similar to the shape of a bulldog's existed, called the Nyata cow, says Dr. Laura Wilson, from the University of New South Wales. The animal was documented by Charles Darwin, during a visit to the Argentinian Pampas, and areas around Buenos Aires in the 1840s. The renowned researcher was baffled by its appearance, and how this affected its functioning and relationship to other cows. Using techniques not available at the time, scientists are now able to piece together some of the mystery. In our study, we set out to find out more about some of the animal's anatomical and genetic characteristics, says co-author Professor Sanchez Villagra, a scientist at the University of Zurich. Our principal finding is that the Narada was a taurine breed, unique among cattle. The team used computational modeling techniques to assess the Nyata's eating abilities based on its unusual face. And they found it likely was similar to many cows. Until this paper, no attempt to use new and useful methods to understand the anatomy and the evolution of this peculiar cow has ever been made, Sanchez Villagra said. We used genetics, non-invasive imaging and engineering inspired biomechanical analyses, tools unavailable at Darwin's time. The study has confirmed that the extinct cow is what's known as a true breed. Domestication basically mirrors what we see happening in natural selection, an observation that has fascinated and challenged scientists since Darwin, Dr. Wilson says. The Nyata cow represents an example of extinction of rare breeds. Understanding aspects of its biology allows scientists to better understand how threatened species may be supported. While we don't really know why the Nyata went extinct, detailed studies of its populations over time do not exist, we can make good guesses. We now know that in spite of the singularity of the Nyata, this cow was able to eat and live like any other cow. Its extinction was then not the result of being unfit, instead, its extinction in Argentina occurred in parallel with the intensification of cattle raising, and with the search for the optimal breed. This meant that fewer breeds were exploited and many became extinct.